Spokane. So here we are in part two. Um, I purposely let it go um, for the for that. I, I had that, that that little gap there. Um, so I, I'm, I'm just letting I'm just I'm just gonna let him know all the Spokane that are on the field. Thirty-four hundred now. So now I'm just, I'm just gonna show you guys how to, how to use Honest. Hopefully he doesn't mirror force or something, because that that would kind of mess this up. So now when you attack into a monster and you're using a light monster, you're being attacked. Just just reveal the Honest in your hand first. Because sending it to the graveyard isn't a cost, I don't believe. Um, it might be a cost. I don't think that it is. I'll double check that. Which I just reveal it to see if your opponent has, has, any, has any response to to honest. Um, so that would would make you gain the attack of, of your opponent's monster. I think that he just wasn't paying attention to something. I don't know. Um, but that's how you use honest. It's not really a, a big deal. He's, he's going to deep prison. Okay, that, that means that honest couldn't have been used. It's not really a big deal. Um, and for those that don't know, the reason that Honest couldn't have been used is because Honest activates in the damage step. Deepers has to has to activate uh, at at calculation or at at um, at, dec at declaration. Um, I don't. I'm not gonna type of why. Um, but this is this is something else I'm I'm gonna have it in, in the tutorial is the different parts of of the battle phase because that's that's something that 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 that's really confusing to a lot of people even 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 some professional players don't really understand it too well it took me a long time to understand it so um so I'm just gonna set the magical hats he knows that I'm gonna activate the magical hats we arranged that be, uh, beforehand just for the just for the demo. Just so that you guys know how it works. Um, and the reason I chose Magical Hats is because it's it's played in Gear Town, and there were a lot of people wondering how to use it because you can't um, because you can't shuffle up your monsters. Um, so your opponent would still know where where your monster is as opposed to your Gear Town and whatnot. Um, So he's gonna bring out the knight's end sword here. That's that's uh, that's unpleasant. But, oh well. Actually, this this will be a lot longer than though I thought it was gonna be. Um. And then and then he's gonna synchro himself. I'm gonna tell him not to use the effect because he, cause I, ha I I need the monster in the field for magical hats. I 
Okay, he wasn't going to anyway, so. Um. So once he attacks, and I use magical hats, and I show you guys how it works. It's really simple. Um. I think I'll book a life. Get rid of my knight and sorcerer. Now, as you can see, he beat, he beat me to it because you can, as I showed in the last video, I believe, or the video before it, you can uh, remove from play from your opponent's graveyard. So now, so now, so now he's going to attack me with anything. And when I do the magical hats, this is how it works. First thing that like, they, they have to do is set your monster face down. Um, just because it, uh, it switches to face on defense anyway. And then view your deck, find two spell and trap cards, and just mill them to, to your graveyard because that's that, that's where they're going anyway. I'm gonna choose an, another magical hats. A terraforming. It doesn't doesn't matter. And now I'm gonna tell him how to do it because he I'm pretty sure he doesn't know either. Um, but how you do it is you roll a dice and then just tell just tell your opponent what's the monster. Um, what, what, what's, what's, and then what's each other card. So, um, so, 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 when your opponent attacks, now they, they have to roll a dice. They got the five, so that kills off the tower for me. And, and after the second attack, just, you kind of roll a dice again and do one, two, and three as a monster. Or you can just flip a coin for it. Either one works. Um, just so that, just so that it's random, it's fair because your cards will be shuffled up anyway. Um, there might be a way to do this later on. Um, but this this is how you have to do it now. So so now he has some magical hats, and that will leave him with just the monster. Um, so there's nothing else to do as far as the, as that's concerned. And now with this final attack, he can kill the exemplar. Um, I should have waited for him to do the animation. It's not really important. Or he's gonna die either way. Um, so now it's my turn, and I'm just gonna pause the video for a second just until he can get the card that he needs to show the last thing I want to show in this video. And now we're back. The last thing I, just, I want to show you guys is, is what happens when your opponent plays a field spell and you already have one, or vice versa. Um, so I'm just going to end my turn because it's not important. Um, he's going to actually to win this turn. Um, Again, it's not important, it's not a big deal. So, so, now, so now when he plays the zombie world, the background does change. So the newest field spell, uh, the newest field spell of mine isn't destroyed automatically. You have to go over here and do that yourself. It's not really a big deal. Um, but the background does change automatically for you. Um, so, and then with that, he will, you know, I'm, I'm just going to get I'm not going to use a mirror force just because I believe that he would have game if I don't. I'm not too sure. Um, 18 plus 19 is 37. 6,000. Now he won't have game. But just for the demo purposes, let's just pretend that he does. Um, just just so I can show you guys how to. Well, what happens when you when you admit defeat? Um, you just go over here and can press the admit defeat button. 
It will ask you yes or no to confirm. You hit yes. Um. Just, just hit yes, and then, and then, and then you hit the OK button. Now your offer draw and your admit defeat button aren't uh, aren't active anymore. If you admit defeat, um, in a ranked in a rated game, then 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 your rating will go up and down. Um, if you if you scroll over your uh, either your avatar or your opponent's avatar, it shows your rating and then your reputation. So here's where where you can check your rating, and I believe that, that that's all the features. Uh, both uh, basic and advanced of the dueling network. Oh, and here's a watcher's chat as well. I forgot to mention that one. Um, we here's where you, here's where you can see um, all the watchers talk, like chaos haze and, and heroes that are there. So, um, so yeah, so that's so that's how you use dueling networks. So hopefully, that helped uh, you new, uh, the newer players that want to try it and are having some problems. Um, as always, with the rest of my videos, I'm just going to ask you to rate, comment, and subscribe. Since these weren't duels, I'm not asking for for questions at the end of them. I'm just hoping that it helped out. So, thank you guys for watching, and hopefully, hopefully that, uh, this helps out everyone.